Hey there boys and girls, like school fake here and welcome back to another Battlefield 4 video and it feels good to commentate again. So um, I haven't been posting too many videos recently so um, this week and over the weekend the last one. Uh, reason being was I had finals, I haven't had much time to make lots of videos um, but I hope my perfectionist, no not perfectionist, but my anti-hero montage um, made up for it. Um, it seemed like lots of you guys actually enjoyed it and this makes me really happy in return so thanks a lot for all the support and just liking the video I guess um, really makes me happy. But yeah, um, since we're talking about anti-hero already I have like lots and loads of leftover clips so if, you're an, uh, if you are an editor and you want to edit my leftover clips for a leftover montage so the leftover clips for anti-hero they're not bad like they're okay for a montage but um, like not the, the level I wanted it to be an anti-hero. So if you're interested in that just um, PM me on YouTube or Twitter or just wherever you want to PM me. I don't know, just get in contact with me and let me know if you want to um, edit my stuff, the, the leftover montage. Yeah, um, another thing would be that um, I'm kind of feeling sorry for DICE, I guess is how you could say. I'm also feeling sorry for lots of the players, so don't get me wrong. I know that the current patch with the SLI being broken as well as the crossfire. The, all the crashes for the people, um, the lag, the netcode, the hit detection, the hit registration, um, the the vehicle collision. Uh, there, there are lots of bugs. The game is definitely not finished, but I guess that normally I would say that's EA's fault because they're the money horse. Because DICE always fell for me. Yeah, right here, getting shot behind the cover. But DICE always fell for me like the company just wants to make a game that people are actually enjoying. And this is another thing. Um, these kind of commentary topics like I'm feeling sorry for DICE and I'm explaining what's happening like what I think what I feel I want to get your guys input on it and um, I will be doing lots of those commentaries again um, right now I'm mainly focusing on tips and tricks because that's what most people want to see and also makes sense if the game is pretty new like it is right now and um, I'm just saying that because um, lots of new subscribers came in with um, Battle 4 so if you do not know that um, prepare for that. I'm often, for example, like also controversial topics like what's better, mouse and keyboard or the controller, um, also PC versus console and all that stuff. Um, I'm often doing kind of these commentaries as well or is quickscoping overpowered, stuff like that, interesting topics. So prepare for those. These, um, these will come back um, soon, I guess. I just want to finish like the, the first uh, wave of my uh, tips and tutorial videos so you guys are up to date with how it's going. And later on I will update them just as I always do, so you can check back at my old Battlefield 3 videos if you do not know what I mean. And it I, I think it should be pretty clear pretty fast. Also we're playing with the shotgun on Operation Meat Locker, Meat Grinder, uh, Metro? I don't know. Well, Metro too. Yeah. Don't like the map that much, but I thought uh, some shotgun gameplay every once in a while would be interesting, so here you go. Um, another real quick thing would be that um, would you guys like some DayZ? So standalone is out. I already bought it. I already played with it. If you would like some videos, let me down. Let me know in the comment section down below. Just say I want DayZ, and maybe I will, or just tell me, do you want DayZ videos like posting episodes, or do you want me to live stream DayZ? Just post in the videos. No, in the comments down below. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, so confused. But yeah, I think it's pretty much all for now. So I hope you enjoyed the video and like, skill figure out.